control the public mind. From our hearts, and our words, and our minds, we open ourselves to Goddess. We give thanks to the earth, and to the water, to the air, and to the fire. We contemplate the space we dance in, and those who dance with us. Fill the vessel. Empty the vessel. Fill the vessel. Empty the vessel. Fill the vessel. Empty the vessel. And we give thanks. DJs have taken over the world, and so has electronic music. We're trying to bring balance by incorporating acoustic instruments into a live ambient breakbeat setting. Manipulating sequences in real time, playing with loops and filters, playing the drums as well, singing. My name is Mr. Ryder, and I am not a DJ. I guess what we're trying to do is fuse electronic and acoustic instruments. Lance plays guitars, Stratocaster, Telecaster, Slide, Effects, Lots. The Roy plays bass very well, in fact. Even though I manipulate sequences and loops and filters in real time, I'm not a DJ. DJs play records. Musicians make records for DJs to play. Some people would say that the democratization of music and technology is a bad thing. Because with computer-generated and electronic music today and the tools that are available to the average computer user, with those tools, anyone can create music. Traditional musicians may feel threatened by this new technology and the advent of the mouse-clicking music maker wannabe DJ. Some would even say that the DJ has killed the radio star. But I say, why not embrace this new technology? Why not fuse the elements of the DJ and the traditional musician? Why not continue to use technology? Why not acknowledge this new creativity? But at the same time, go back to our roots of acoustic music with real instruments. Ride Live celebrates this fusion and creates its own brand of electroacoustic music. I believe that the DJ has furthered our concept of what creativity should be, and tools and elements of the DJ are part of the new creativity. Rider, and this is the ride live.